hello 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 guys i'm back again with another video as you can see um and you know what i'm not even gonna apologize for how i look right now basically my hair's a mess and at the moment what i'm trying to do is give you guys you know a little nice hairstyle that you can do when your hair isn't looking great so basically if you guys don't know when you do a wash and go sometimes your hair can just decide that it just wants to do what it wants to do so i'm going to use this opportunity to do my nice little you know messy bun that i like to do and it's going to keep me hopefully until wash day so the products i like to use eco styler never does me wrong i'm still riding with it can it just is my favorite thing and then i like to use my gummy wax literally i had this when i went on holiday and then they chucked it so i bought another one and i don't even mind i don't remember how much it was but this if you're looking for something to slick your hair and nothing does it this will do it mix it with eco styler and that's it no one can tell you different also have my denim brush over here my little toothbrush edges brush that i like to do do a bit of that with and a slip brush but i'm gonna find my other one i don't like this one so first things first this is my hair at the moment like most of the time people don't see the glam people just see the glamorous side like this is me when i'm at home i'm so sorry this is literally it but um i'm going to get my trusty my water bottle and just really just spray it all around don't forget the back. Yeah, and now I spray so much water on it, it looks basically white. I am going to get my Denman brush and kind of just brush out any kinks. Okay, so I brought all my hair up like so, and do you know what? This would be so cute as a little puff situation. But I really, really need to keep my hair in a sort of bun because at the moment it is getting cold, it's starting to rain, and I just don't want my hair to melt up or anything. So going straight into a bun. So because I already have done a wash and go, I have quite a bit of gel in my hair. But that's not going to stop me. <laughs> I'm still going to put a lot more in. But as you can see here, it slicks up quite nicely. So now, I'm going to take my really sad looking old <laughs> elastic thing hairband and just basically tie my hair up like this. So the key to this is like making sure that you get it in the right place. I like my a bit on top of my head to just to make sure that I'm able to get a really nice sort of top bun situation going on. So I get my elastic and then I put one side under my arm, my hand, and then wrap around. And then I'm going to tie at the back. And then I end up just tucking this, but do you know how cute this is? So next, what I like to do is just, this is kind of like a hit or miss sort of situation. It is all freehand. Um, as you can see, my hair is looking all types. I've got some curly bits, some matty bits, some bits that want to do whatever they want, but we're going to use opportunity to create something nice, fun, and messy. So what I like to do is grab my hair, all together like so and do a sort of twist like so and then I like leave the ends here so I do this and I grab myself another hairband and just place that on top okay next what I like to do it looks like a normal bun so now I just like to fill out some pieces 
and this is like as I said the part where you can just make it your own um, I like to just ooh, spray a little here and there uh, let me just zoom out a bit so you guys can see it better okay so this is the part where I just play around with it a bit more um, so I grab some pieces from my hair you can see here and then I get my eco styler again and this is where I just get the little curly look so I So before we go on to finish the bun situation, as I said, it's really just kind of like a freehand thing. I like to get some more of my eco styler and just basically place that on my edges. So I place that all along my hair, even though my hair looks slick now, give it like two seconds and it will frizz up. So that's why I always like to go in with just a bit more eco styler, but if you feel like your hair doesn't frizz up like that, don't need to add any more gel. So next I like to go in with my, it's my trusty brush over here and I really just do my edges like this. I hold the top and then see. Um, I will be looking in the mirror like this over there. Um, so don't mind me if I, you see me, you know, looking in that direction. And then I add accordingly. And I do the exact same thing on the side. So to really really seal in this front view that I have going on and my edges, I always like to go in with some gummy wax just to make sure that nothing is moving or nothing is out of place. So to make sure this does last me a while, let's go with my headscarf. There is no point trying to be cute if you can't go through this process. The headscarf comes on um, and this is basically what I do. I kind of do my hairstyles for work the night before. And I just, you know, take it out of my headscarf and run for my drink. <laughs> That's literally me. Um, I put my headscarf just like so. And my curls do, if people are going to ask how do I get my curls that are out here to not get crushed. They do get crushed sometimes and I just add some gel in the morning. So I just pop it on like so. So what this does, it just preserves my edges and my curls as I go to bed and I'm on my merry way. Just like so. But as I always like to say at the end of my videos, thank you so much for watching. This is the finished look. Ciao. See you in the next one.